Good morning. This is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Come what may, I'm going to pray. Come what may, I'm going to praise. We're going to pray. We're going to exalt the Lord. Exalt the Lord our God and worship at his feet for he is holy. For the Lord our God is holy. Um, Isaac has been having really bad aggressive meltdowns and Chuck and I are so exhausted. Um, but I just have a couple of urgent prayer requests. My friend Magali, her son Adil, um, he was using drugs and walking around and they police got him and took him to the hospital and he's on a 5150 hold. Um, and so if you've ever known anyone that has used drugs or alcohol, it's such an evil, evil um, thing. And he really, really, really needs help. And we pray for him so much. And I'm actually happy that he's on a 5150 hold because I know that he can't hurt himself. So if you could please pray for me. I know it's kind of a different name. It's Adil, A-D-I-L. Please pray for him. Please um, uh, ask others to pray for him. Um, please, please, please spread that name out. Write it in your journal. Um, Psalm 18, by my God, I could scale a wall. The Lord is my rock and my fortress, my deliverer, my God, and my strength. Please pray and join me in praying that Adil would be uh, healed. And we, we, in the name of Jesus, the Lord rebuke any demons off of him. Also, um, we want to pray for her, uh, Yoon, my friend Sandy's dad, who's been, um, you know, he has these dizzy spells. He's on a lot of medications for Parkinson's. And I believe he's in the hospital right now. Um, and it's just uh, tremendously hard on his wife. And, you know, he, he's not able to articulate what he feels. Oh, I feel lightheaded. Maybe I should sit down. He can't do that. Just similar to Isaac. So I want to pray for, um, for Yoon. Eunice is his name. And then, um, and Adil. And, um, yeah, just if you guys could all please just continue to pray for me and Chuck and my son. Um, it's just hard. Summer is hard. Like anything that's like a break, Christmas break, Easter break, Memorial Day. Labor Day, anytime, even if it's a three-day weekend, he just, it's just hard for him. I, I don't know how to explain it. He doesn't do well with downtime. He does well with structure. And even though we're giving him structure right now, we're at the same walk that I've been taking him since 2020, COVID, even before 2020. He knows Benelli like the back of his hand. He probably could walk this loop all by himself, even though he doesn't really talk. He could do it. He would know the, the, the loop, like, so familiar. So even though we try to give him familiar, he has the pull. He's been swimming a lot. He's just been not happy and and pinching and it's just hard. So anyway, Father God, I just praise you. Thank you for being our Father, our Abba. Lord, you are the great and powerful God. You are I am. You are high and lifted up. You are all-consuming fire, ancient of days. You are the rose of Sharon, the balm in Gilead. You are a soon incoming king, Lord. If we don't have you, we have nothing. But since we have you, we can we can do it. We can get through this life. And I hate the way that sounds, get through this life, like if it's a drudgery. But right now, we're in the battle. I can't imagine anybody being in a war and thinking, this is pleasant, this is fun. No, it's not. It's hard. But your word says, let not, let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me and my father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you, I'd go to prepare a place for you. That where I am, there you might be also. And you said, peace I leave unto you. My peace I give unto you, not as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled. I'm preaching to myself, King Jesus. Would you preach that word over me, King Jesus, and over all of us praying together. Forgive us of our sins, for there are many. Pride, stubbornness, selfishness, anxiety, complaining. Lord, it's been hot here in Southern California. How much complaints do we hear left and right? It's hot, it's hot, I'm bored, it's hot. Lord, we are not to complain against you. Yes, that's reality, it's hot. We could take a cold shower, we have cold water to drink. We have an air-conditioned car. There's so many things that we could be thankful for and we should be thankful for. So forgive us of our complaints. They are not right and they grieve your heart because you gave up your own son. Thank you, Father. And so, Lord Jesus, I also pray right now. Well, first, before I intercede, I want to give thanks. Give thanks with a grateful heart. Thank you for the cross. Thank you for your blood. Thank you that by your stripes we're healed. 
thank you that we're going to heaven. This is not our permanent home. This is not our permanent residence. This is not our permanent resting place. This is not our permanent address. We pray for Adil and Yoon and Isaac and all those hurting right now, asking in faith, King Jesus, for a healing, for a miraculous touch and for intervention, Lord, please. We need a breakthrough. Thank you that the God of heaven's armies is on our side. In Jesus' name, amen.